My teachers believe in the philosophy that if children aren't learning the way that they are teaching, then they need to change the way that they teach. It is easier to change the way that an educator teaches than it is to change the way a child learns. The Vision 2016 is about achievement for all. Um, it's about closing the achievement gap. Uh, and that's what the bridge uh, framework does. It helps us to close the achievement gap, and that's what we're trying to do. The bridge is a pilot system. We're trying to use the 14 schools to work out any kind of kinks that may arise. Uh, so give us again, give us a chance to understand the system and to better it as we go along. Our goals in 2016 are to improve the student achievements and close the achievement gap. And with Bridge, we, if we improve our teacher achievement, we're improving student achievement. And we're closing that achievement gap between all students. Every classroom will be led by an effective teacher. For years we've been looking for a reliable, effective way to evaluate teachers and to reward them for going that extra mile and the bridge program provides that. It provides them with the reward if the uh, student make, meet the goals and objectives and make improvements. It provides them with uh, continuous professional development which we've always wanted and it provides them with a fair reliable observation tool to, to evaluate them. The bridge work is, is so important because it provides the bridge, so to speak, the bridge that connects all of us in Charleston County teachers, uh, principals, students. The ultimate goal is to increase student achievement. And when we all have an effective way of making that happen that's consistent, no matter um, where teachers may teach, what they teach, or who they teach, regardless of socioeconomic background, race, gender, etc., it provides that common, common ground for all of us, for all the teachers to improve because it is hard work and teachers need to be rewarded for the hard work that they do. The bridge framework has three components. Bridge Grow gives teachers uh, feedback on their performance uh, using fair and reliable measures. That is a very important part of it. The second component is Bridge Learn where we have additional resources to provide targeted professional development, individual professional development, and personalized learning for teachers and for principals so they can get better at what they do. And the third component is Bridge Award, and that means those teachers and principals who are achieving superior results will be eligible for additional compensation. I thought that it was important to get involved in the beginning stages of the bridge work, um, even though we are not a pilot school, because I could see the, the purpose was to focus on results, at the same time to focus on collaboration, where different people and different stakeholders were coming together to focus on outcomes and measuring data and having professional discussions about that. Although St. James St. T is not uh, one of the pilot schools, it's very similar. We face a lot of the same challenges as some of the other schools that are in the pilot program. I've been out there for six years and I understand the frustrations that some of the teachers have where they work really hard and the students grow, but it's not to the point where the educators are necessarily recognized. And this seemed like a really good opportunity for teachers, regardless of the overall growth, to be recognized for the individual student growth. And I wanted to be part of that and making sure that everyone felt validated in what they did. I want to be on the cutting edge of the change. And you know, change is never easy, but change is always warranted. So I wanted to be in that pool of having that discussion of how can we change? Because in Charleston County, we're all about excellence. And this is a plan that will say, yes, we are an excellent district. We have the very best educating our children. So I wanted to be in the midst of that discussion, in the midst of that change agent. We have been told from the beginning of this program being put in our school that we are educators helping educators. That's why we are a pilot at school. We are working it out for everybody else in the district. And my, my teachers are embracing that. To my colleagues that are not a part of the pilot program as of yet, I want them to know that we think this is a great idea we're hoping that we can do a great, great job so that this gets included to the whole entire district. Um, we're doing everything we want to do to make that happen, but as everyone knows, pilot is a pilot.
One of the exciting parts of the bridge work to me is the specific and targeted conversations that educators will have. Uh, very data-based and data-driven conversations that will be able to be specific to the third grade teacher's math class or the seventh grade teacher's reading instruction. Uh, and from that, it would only make sense that it would have a powerful impact on student outcomes and results. The bridge work is important because it allows us to really realize our value in promoting Vision 2016, making sure that students understand we are here for them and for us to understand we are here for them. Even if I am in my first year teaching or my 20th year teaching, there's always going to be something for me to learn and a way for me to be a better instructor because my students every year are different and the needs that they're going to have every year are different. So the type of teacher I need to be every year changes. My approach to teaching is to help create social change. Students become members of, they are already members of society, but they have to contribute in a larger way once they get out of school. And if we haven't equipped them with the proper tools to give them the options in life, it, you know, it's a pretty destitute existence. And we need to make sure that that doesn't continue. The time has come. It's time for all of us to get on board. It's time for all of us to elevate our profession to the level it deserves and the bridge work provides the, the avenue for that to happen, that we can't wait for change. We have to be a part of that change, and we need to make sure that it's consistent. We need to make sure that it's fair. We need to make sure that it's rewarding based on the work that you do. So if it's happening in the district, it's about time for all of us because it's gonna happen without us. So let's be a part of it and make it happen. I've said to our teachers here in the 14 Pilot School, uh, just continue to work hard and do what you do for our children and you won't have a problem with Bridge. Bridge is just another name for what we do every day and it is to educate our children.